Thank you. 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 Let me check the next one really quick. Hold on a momentito. Hey guys, welcome. Hi. Welcome, hi, I'm Dr. Kometz. Welcome into the office. Hi. Good to meet you. Hi there. Magnus. Good to meet you, Magnus. No need to get up for me. Right. All right. When did, uh, when did everything start happening, buddy? Um, so I went to the gym uh, very early in January. And yep. I had sort of, uh, I did a deadlift and I felt something. Yep. And then 24 hours later, I struggled to get out of bed, but it was sort of okay. I could get out, didn't have too much pain. I just couldn't uh, stand up straight. Yep. I was completely like this. Yep. Went to the hospital after a few days. They scanned me and said, you know, there's something there. We can see a little herniated disc. Yep. And he said, give it four weeks and it's going to be fine. So yep. I just took it easy and didn't really do much. Yep. Um, then we came here. Um, and then Where were you from? You're, you live in China? Yeah, we live in China from Denmark. Okay. Um, then we flew here and obviously the flight wasn't comfortable, but nothing special. Of course. We had a few days up in uh, San Francisco walking <laughs> around all good. Yep. Then one morning, uh, putting the kids into the car, you know, sitting inside of a car, having to move them around. They're small, but still. Yep. And then suddenly, it's something yeah. really painful. Yep. Uh, at the time, didn't think much of it. Was able to drive the whole day. Um, at night, waking up, a lot yes. of pain in the, in the left leg, which is yep. the problem all the time. Worse when you sit for a while. If you sit in a seat for a while, does it get really bad? Well, after that, I, yes. I can't stand. I can't, I, I can't can. sit. Yeah. The, I mean, Before that, was it worse sitting for extended periods? Yeah. 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 I mean, I, it, it started sort of being uncomfortable, but I could sort of, you know, get through it. You can move it, yeah. Now it's, it's okay. Nice. This, was, this happened in San Francisco then? Well, the, yeah, on the way, f yeah, what is it, Monterey, I think. Mon okay, while you were driving down. Yeah, while we were driving okay. down. Okay, okay. I think that's four nights ago. Okay. So I've had four bad nights and okay. five bad days. Okay. Well, it's about time for them to start getting better. Okay. Uh, are you able to sit at all for a minute? Uh, maybe a minute, yeah. Yep, okay. Pull your shirt off before you do it, because if we're going to sit, we're going to make it worth it. See if you can come over to the seat. Take your time coming into that seat there, and I'll... Uh... So over here? Or... Yep, right here, right here, right here. Okay. Just sit down here just for a minute. So I'm just checking to see if there's any nerve interference. Just hang in there, buddy. So what it does is it, it picks up in the um, signals. Okay, so I'm feeling very little, I'm seeing very little reading down there. Make sure this is on. Did you have any ice on this here? No. Okay. I've applied heat. Applied heat, okay. So very little reading on that. Let me take that. Right. I'm going to poke on you for a minute. <clears throat> I'm going to set you. Hang in there. I'm going to poke on you here. Yeah. And tender it in here, Magnus? No, or okay. when I go to here? It's okay. It's okay, it's all right. Special. Okay. Stay right here. Sit back in this chair just for a minute. I'm going to take care of this neck right away. Right. Take your glasses off for a second, buddy. I know you're hurting. I know you're hurting. Turn this way to the left. Keep your shoulders yeah, here. I can feel down in the spine. Yep. Turn this way to the right. Turn to the left here. Again. And turn back to the right. Okay, relax here. For tender Magnus here? Yeah. Or more tender when I go to here? Uh, yeah, but more on the left. No, no, thank you. Look straight ahead. Okay. I got you. Oh, the lower back is really bad now. Okay. Do whatever you got to do. Oh, okay. Okay. Pressure off the back. Yep. Uh, I'm with you. But that felt good though, once you just sit there. Yeah, I think there's uh, not a lot of pressure I'm seeing at the top. Yeah. Uh, around the bottom here. There may be, there may be more pressure here, but I think right in the top, we got to set that first and okay. we'll, we'll take care of everything, don't worry. Hang in there, buddy. I just whenever I'm ready, getting back on. Yep, that's going to be the tough part. I mean, I think it's just a matter of just getting it done right and then whenever the, the pain's too much, just get back down. Uh, you, you, could say, you could stay there for a second. I'm going to set that just a little bit deeper and I still didn't see anything here, so let's see what we got. Okay, still staying, still staying very quiet. So there's something else coming. Okay, let me take that again. Yeah. Come back this way one more time. I'm gonna set that. I'm gonna jump on that like right away. Can I use my arms here to sort of take yep. the pressure off? And then the I'll tell you when to relax. I'll tell you when to just put your head back. Okay, let your whole body r drop for a second. Relax your shoulder. Okay. Okay, now you can relax. Go do what you need to do for a second. I'll be back in in a minute, okay? Yeah. Hang right there. That's supposed to protect that nerve. Under stress, it moves backwards. It can't go forward. There's a joint there. Right. 
There's nothing stopping it from moving back. Right. And when it does, it starts to choke off that nerve, okay? And when that happens, um, if it's bad enough, your body will start to spasm. Now, what's really happening is you're herniating the disc. The inflammation from the disc is compressing that nerve, right. okay? So uh, the way the body adapts is it'll put you in an intelligent position. So you're bent over right now. That's intelligent for your body because you're, you, there's, it's so bad. That nerve is, is being hurt so bad right now that your body will spasm to keep you away from putting more stress on that. That's why you're comfortable in some positions, okay? So what we do is we need to take that, we need to set that vertebrae and get that pressure off that nerve. Now, I'm not finding any pressure down there. Most people I would see that'd be blowing up. That ain't blowing up on you. It's coming up from the top. Right. So now, just so you know, everything is, everything is connected, okay? All these things, everything is the, the, the connected. So when I'm setting something up here, it'll absolutely affect something down here. Right. That one is a picture of a guy with um, uh, torticollis. His problem was up here. He had a problem in his sacrum. Right. Same. Right. Now it's you. It seems to be the opposite here. We're gonna. You're still gonna have to get those things fixed at the bottom, but um, right. uh, but we're, we're just gonna try to get you up now, right. upright. Okay. Okay. Now the other thing too is when you get back into the gym, you're gonna want to lay off the deadlifts. You should be doing like single leg squats and stuff right. like that. Right. Yeah. But deadlifts and squats will, will will make it worse. Single leg stuff you could do heavy. Okay. okay. But but not but based on your X-ray. Right. Uh, not. Right. So um. Well, that's like period. You think? With what? Deadlift. What's that? That's period. No more. Oh uh, yeah, never. There's no reason. I mean, I mean, do, uh, half arm and stuff. And okay. Stuff, but not, not professionally, you know. Okay. Okay. Yeah, if that's what you like to do, you mean you can't think of anything else to do with your time? <laughs> I mean, Chris, seriously, you can't go to look at all this the waste time. You could go to the gym during that time, man. It'd be great. Yeah, that's a good point. All right, uh, but no, you can get away with doing that. It's just the deadlifts and the squatting right. and stuff. Drop your head a little bit. Good job, you're doing good, buddy. It's just not a lot of pressure there. Okay, let's see if we can do this. You okay? Oh, that's painful when you that's touch that. Right. Oh. oh, wow, that's really painful. Okay. Oh. We'll hold off for a second, okay? Yeah. Chill here for a minute, however you need to do it, okay? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna roll you in here a little bit. Are you okay when I do that? Yeah. Yeah. Still okay there? Just a little bit of crack there. Uh, you okay there? Yeah. Okay, just All relax good. here for a second. All good. Okay, good. So we got a little bit better motion out of that, that yeah. sacrum. Right side and left. Okay, we're gonna get you some ice here for a minute. Yeah. Yeah. Well, uh, I mean, this morning, uh, probably I could walk around for a minute or so, having okay. to go back down and relieve the, the pressure. Okay. Uh, now I feel like I could probably just stand for as long as I want to. Okay, but that's it's, about it, just standing, it's, it's, right? It's, it's really a lot better now. Okay, so we'll check you out and we'll see if any of the intelligent. Don't try to, don't try to straighten yourself, don't look at yourself in the mirror like this and try to straighten yourself out. Your body's Very putting that way for a reason, okay? Yeah, right. So don't try, to, don't try to mess it up, let your body heal you up, okay? And then we'll catch up with you on Monday, okay? Yeah, perfect. Hopefully you guys will be good Appreciate before you get out of here. Huh?